Three, two, one. Activate. Earlier today, we had our two heats in a fully replicated, minimalistic version of the war zone itself with floor flipper and pit of oblivion too. Pants in the pink first to show of these micro machines pushing militant away. Buzzant has that 3,000 RPM ripsaw and looked effective. So too lower with that razor s claw. Pants and Militant had their own fight. Pants very effective. So too lower as they got to grips with minimalistic. Enough to get them the judge's nod. And Pants went with them, grasping the serpent. Pants and lower on a judge's decision. Cease. Two, one, activate. In the second heat, Hades, bottom of the picture, had steering problems and others besides. Combatant with a yellow logo and chroma snapped and snarled. Anti B scuttling away, a mini Bearmoth pushing and nudging. Mesma 2 was spinning out of control and going nowhere. Hades went into the pit, competent teetered and looked gone to me. Chroma and Anti B were having a great fight. Now watch for Combatant. Flipped out of the pit from Hades to heaven in one move. I wish it was as easy as that. And as Anti Geddon was pressurized, Competent flipped itself through the air, catching the eye. Anti Geddon in trouble, really. No recovery, absolutely shredded by the four ants of the apocalypse. Anti B was looking strong for me. Competent and Chroma still in there. The end of Anti Geddon. Mesma 2 going nowhere, top of the picture. Chroma on its side, couldn't self right. Combatant and anti B through, though Combatant ended in the pit again. So there you are, it's peaceful in the arena now, but in just seconds, mayhem will be unleashed. Anti B is your robot, yes. Anthony. Yep. And uh, what's your battle plan? Try and see if I can get one of them out of the arena. Uh huh, okay, <laughs> that's not going to be easy. Um, your robot is? Combatant. Your plan is? to try and bash them and smash them up, basically. <laughs> OK, your robot is? Lower. Your plan is? To crush them. Who are you most worried about? Pete, over there, because right. he chops everyone up. Ah, OK. And how about you, Pants? Well, I'm hoping that my pants will stay intact until the end. <laughs> That's the most important thing. Are these just as lethal as the big robots? Oh, absolutely, even more so. You'll see more damage here than you will anywhere else. They truly believe. Let mini battle commence. Two, one, activate. Lower, first to move, mind you, it was halfway across the arena when it moved. There's the reigning champion, combatant, flipped, spinning. How much damage is that course to the reigning champion, I wonder? Again, slammed by Lower with a Razor S type claw. They're after the reigning champion early on again. It's flipped away in the pink pants, top of the picture. Moving out of danger, Anti B again, slamming in on combatant. Are the wheels moving on Combatant? I think they're first to go, they've gone! They're out, Combatant, the reigning champion is out, I think immobilised. Pants, pressurised by Anti B. Pants there, controlled by Pete Collier. Anti B by Anthony Pritchard from a formidable roboteering family. Now trying to pressurise lower, can they topple lower? They're trying to push into a, a mini, mini CPZ. Look at the work done here by Anti B. They say Ants have a prodigious work rate, and he's doing just that. Uses the Bearmoth type shovel to upend lower. Still fighting the two of them. Are these the best two? Pants still surviving, out of the picture at the moment. Anti B pushes lower into the CP set. There you can see Pants coming back into the picture. All Anti B is seen, topples Pants over onto its side. It's all Anti B for me, but can he finish them off? Pants. Immobilised on the floor flipper and gone. Spinning away, but I don't think they can play any further part. For me, then it's Anti B and lower into the CPZ again. Anti B, can they finish lower off? Lower's wheels aren't turning. Anti B has won. The weight champion, and rightly so.